Am I the asshole? For bringing a generic product versus the name, brand I was asked to bring. This seems so silly to me, but it became such a big deal I have to ask. Last weekend, my girlfriend's family hosted a BBQ Kwai. I was always raised to never show up anywhere empty-handed, so I asked my girlfriend's mom what I could bring. She asked that I grab the cool whip for a dessert she was making. Um, easy enough. I figured it won't be hard to find, so I decide to wait until morning of to grab it on my way there. While I get to the store about 20 minutes before the BBQ starts, and they're somehow out of the name brand. They did, however, have the store brand's whipped topping. As I didn't have time to go to another grocery store, I just bought the generic brand and headed off. Upon arrival, I hand the bag to my girlfriend's mom. She opens it, looks inside, and gets a weird look on her face. She asks where the cool whip is. I see the store was out, but this is pretty much the same thing, right? She looks a little irritated with me, but just tells me to make myself at home. As I'm putting my stuff down, I hear her asking her husband to arm to the store and grab the cool whip. I can't hear the entire conversation, but he must have asked, didn't I bring it because I then hear her say, I asked for one thing, and he couldn't even deliver. Nothing else was said directly to me, but there were a few passive-aggressive remarks throughout the BBQ. Such as when her husband arrived, name, brand in hand, calling him her hero. When the dessert was served, she again made a comment about how it's made with real cool whip. I didn't want to make a scene, so I took it on the chin. When talking to my girlfriend about it later, she said that her mom was overdramatic, but I should have called her to ask if generic was okay. Or I could have gone to a different store. I asked if there was really a difference, and she said she doesn't know but it was what I was asked to bring, so I should have communicated better. Again, this all sounds so stupid, but am I the asshole? Not the asshole. You all may not agree, but the mom was extremely rude. Imho. Instead of being grateful, she stabbed OP in the back by talking trash about it. A gracious host is thankful, not condescending, making faces, and talking crap. She's the, ah. Uh. Your GF should have called her mom out about it. Privately, of course. Edit her mom should have served what you bought, and I'm sure it would have tasted just fine. Not the asshole. My dad is one of those generic bad name, brand, good people. My mom and I simply save the name, brand containers clean them and replace them with the generic versions. Trust me, he hasn't noticed. Also, anyone who is using Cool Whip, versus making homemade whipped cream doesn't have a leg to stand on when it comes to taste. The disrespect she showed a guest was gross, and I'd be avoiding being over there if you don't have to. This is a crystal ball into your future if you stay with this girlfriend, and she continues to handle her mom like this. You did nothing wrong. This isn't a diamond TD switcheroo, it's one where frothed up vegetable oil in a blue tub was replaced by the same frothed up vegetable oil in a different color container or one of a slightly different shade of blue. Not the asshole imagine being on your high horse about cool whip, it's already the white trash version of whipped cream. Not the asshole. It is a family, BBQ. The mom and dad need to get over themselves and thank someone for bringing it. No wonder families are destroying themselves. Next time, don't go and enjoy your day without the ahas. Their daughter is entitled as well. Not the asshole. You just got a big red flag not to get involved with this family. I'll bet that mom knows how to hold a grudge. You might want to start looking for signs to see if the apple didn't fall far from the tree. Wow, being snobby about Cool Whip is a weird take. I am serving my guests chemical garbage, but it is name, brand chemical garbage. I have a feeling GF mom had already decided you aren't good enough for her princess, and anything you do is doomed to failure in her eyes. Had you gone to another store to get the name brand, she would have given you side eye for being late. DF knows it too because she said you should have called to ask knowing her mom was going to nitpick no matter what. Not the asshole. Was this written by a marketing intern at Cool Whip? Oh, I'm Nick Warren. Not the asshole in my petty ass would have casually asked the mom at the end of the party to give me the generic tub I brought, 
so that I could enjoy it at home, since it looks like she didn't really need it after all. Looking her straight in the eye and smiling the whole time. It's not about Cool Whip, the generic. Although people do commonly use brand names to describe general items Kleenex, Band-Aids, etc. to rub. It's about the way OP was treated. He was asked to do someone a favor, did the best he could given the time restraints and selection at the store, and then treated like some kind of incompetent idiot. That, or at least, that mother has a serious maturity issue. You are not in any was to top. Not the asshole and your girlfriend really should step in for you. If comments were being made, then mom was throwing shade in front of guests and creating unnecessary family drama. The good partner thing to do it for her to have a conversation with her mother about such behavior over a minor miscommunication. Man, I rear BBQ and thought you got some store brand sauce and I was scared for your well-being. But the off-brand Cool Whip is the same comes off the same lines. She can cool it, not the asshole. What you do is apologize and in the future offer to have her parents over for dinner and dessert. When dessert comes you have something you can put Cool Whip on, get the generic brand, but place it in the Cool Whip container and see if she notices. Totally just being petty and kidding. BW. Also, not the asshole. Not the asshole. Cool Whip isn't even anything fancy. Made with real Cool Whip makes her sound like a fool. Not the asshole in TBH. I'm a little surprised there are so many you're the asshole responses. Most of the time, the difference between most generic brand name products is little to none. I can't speak regarding Cool Whip, but I imagine the difference negligible. Certainly not worth your GF's mother being so passive aggressive. Not the asshole. However, sometimes there is a big difference in taste ingredients. As a person allergic to whey, a dairy derivative, the brand can be extremely important for that ingredient alone. It seems weird that GF mom was so over the top about it. Cool Whip isn't that great anyway, Imo. It's fake whipped cream. Not the asshole, if they are this dramatic on whipped topping, what are they like on more important things? Your girlfriend's comments are also ridiculous. Esh. The way she handled it was bad? Yes. But there are definitely some products where name brand, versus generic makes a difference. Can't speak to Cool Whip because I've never had it, but there have been products where I bought generic once and never again. And really it's on you for not calling to check, particularly since you assumed it would be easy and left it to the last minute. That's on you.